Probably because I was doing something wrong. He's on the other side of that collapsed building. Go. You're right. He is maybe. I don't know. Then I go this way. I mean, with with this game, I was actually playing on a a new HD TV that I never really had because I usually play games on my really old CRT. It was like a small fucking box. Use your ninja van to move over obstacles automatically. <laughs> Thanks, Boris. Yeah, I usually play video games on fucking uh, my really old box. Cut through the gate. Nothing can stop riding, except a lot of things. Because, I mean, I died before. But not in this playthrough. Not right now. Yeah, those of you who have played uh, Metal Gear Solid 2 would know that Raiden had his first kind of debut with that game. And no one knew. God damn it, I jumped over that. Can I guard that at all? Fuck you, dude. I countered your ass. Nice chain board. Do that. And I kick you. What? I see. Use blade mode to take down those heavy missiles. No. I will use my ninja run and spin. <laughs> Who do you think I am, Boris? Ow. Nice face. And nice turret as well. It is dead. Ah! Well, I thought you'd hit me, but I think not. And this is where I get most of my training. Ow! I could never telegraph his attack. Like, I. I never know when he's gonna strike. It should be obvious for you guys, but not for me. You know, I never thought a tiny man with a sword could fucking stop a behemoth of a machine like this. I mean, it's a Metal Gear. And as Kojima has taught us, these things are badasses. But not anymore. Kojima says that Raiden is a badass in his own right. Destroys Metal Gears like a boss. Or not. Yeah, because that made sense. Do it. Do it up. Damn it. I fell in a hole. Uh, and that's what I don't really like about this game, is because there are these segments where you kind of have to, you know, perfectly do everything or you basically die. Such as if you fall in, in a hole, you will die. Which kind of sucks. But I never said I would be playing this game perfectly. I just said I would be playing it. And this is not a blind. And one death later. Huh.
know how come you couldn't run that fast before? After him. Tilt rotor? What is a tilt rotor? I'm not aware of these things, viewer. Let's go, Sam. And what kind of name is Sam anyway? My name is Ryden. Ow. I mean, Sam is a good name too, but Ryden's a way cooler name. It means a uh, lightning or something like that. I can't go up there, dude. Come on. Well, is that all you have? Eat this. Haha. Not half bad. Still. You're all make fun of me. Dude, come on. <laughs> Your technique lacks something. Oh, yeah? Let me show you how I flail my arms around with a sword. Jesus, he can hurt me while I'm guarding. He is hardcore. Now I see. You deny your weapon its purpose. What? Ah! Uh. Jesus. My eye. It yearns to bathe in the blood of your enemies, but you hold it back. No. My sword is a tool of justice.
<laughs> Not again. And yes, that did happen to him before. Are you all right? Ah. Uh, 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 come on, man. Uh, uh, ah, dude, come on. It's not cool. Uh, uh, did you want to practice uh, first? Uh, 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 come on, let me, let me, let me just hit you. Uh, did you want to practice first? Well, I did, but. Uh, What happens when you bring a tool to a sword fight? It's over. <laughs> Lucky devil. <laughs> And then you have to wonder who recovered Raiden's body from the train. Ah, I gotta be. Well, at least it doesn't kind of penalize you for dying, which is a big bitch. Whatever. So yeah, let's keep moving forward, I guess. Because I got 3,000 BP for whatever. Hmm. So good. I've got a clean visual. A direct feed to your optic nerve. <laughs> yes, I should hope so, huh? I mean, how does it feel? To fly like a bird. Like a bird strapped to a remote control rocket. <laughs> we will get you in safely, Tovarich. Just relax and enjoy the ride. Right. Can you hear me, Raiko? Doctor. Remember the two procedures to maintain your new body. One, seizing nano repair units from your foes. And two, absorbing their electrolytes. I got it. Yes, enemy cyborgs should provide plenty of MCFC electrolytes once you slice them open and uh, extract their fluids. They're terrorists. I was planning on that anyway. Oh, and their left hands, if you please. Excuse me? is a combat data stored on holographic memory, typically located in the left hand. That data is very valuable. <clears throat> I am authorized to offer you upgrades and services in exchange for it. How generous. Ich liebe Kapitalismus. Had the world come down a few years earlier, I would have a Nobel Prize on my shelf. There, I see land. Three-mic valve closing. Three-mic valve closing. 
No activity at the airbase. Looks like we don't need to worry about interceptors. Great. Then we have time for a quick brief. I know you miss me, Cap, but I've been all over the materials. <laughs> That's what you said before Montenegro. Look, just humor me, buddy. Objectives, of course, are enter Abkhazia, neutralize the terrorists, and restore the rightful government. Or what's left of it, anyway. The president and most of the cabinet have been killed, and a military junta's been established. The terrorists brain-jacked all the high-ranking officers, and their cyborgs scattered the rank and file. The few leaders who have survived have no way of openly opposing the new regime. That's why they called us. Andrei Dolceyev leader of the occupation forces, an extremist linked to both the St. Petersburg massacre of 2015 and last year's terror spree in Georgia. And his arms supplier, none other than Desperado Enforcement, LLC. Oh. And Bonnie's killers. If we don't stop them here, they could destabilize the entire region. But our more immediate problem is Jetstream Sand. I believe you've met. <sighs> The only problem I see is that nickname. I've got my enhancements this time. He won't be an issue. He may not even be in country, but keep an eye out just in... No. Uh, sorry. Ready for insertion. He's well, riding awesome yet, guys? He's Mercy awesome, right? The waypoint is marked on your sure as hell bet that he's awesome. But, uh, guys, I'm gonna end things off here. So, next time on Metal Gear Rising Revengeance, I'm gonna do the first actual mission. See you then.